went to try to put in a recovery code at Facebook so I could talk longer and uh, help you guys through this. Because uh, um, connecting to human beings and uh, speaking intelligently so they could be more intelligent than treated like animals and believe they're like animals uh, helps. But uh, I tried the thing with Facebook and it's not going through. So it's not, f Facebook can be a pain, but uh, the, the main culprit of genocide operations is mil the military. Okay. And it's been this way for a long time. You know, they, they've been doing uh, population control and manipulating people, thinking they're like spirits of animals and stuff since the uh, Egyptian... Uh, wall paintings and stuff and their scientists and stuff then so you got to understand that these people are symbiotic to their predecessors in the past okay and um they believe you know if we live the lord's prayer that you guys will uh, have lots of you'll feel happy and good and have lots of sex and overpopulate and then um uh, you know they they'll have trouble managing the population and managing the resources we're already destroying and misusing the resources, building million dollar mobile homes to move around and feel, you know, the, uh, successful and adequate and sexually prowess and, and uh, uh, houseboats that go 16 knots with, uh, with helicopter pads and all these disgusting things. It's like, you really think if we live the Lord's Prayer and live like Abraham instead of think we're, we're dogs competing over the top sex cult? Uh, irrational behaviors that will overpopulate the world and destroy the ecosystem? No. Okay. So, guys, um, they're obviously wrong. The science is obviously bad. I'm obviously correct, and I'm not bad. Okay. So, my job, yeah, I can't use Facebook. They won't let me. So, it's the military uh, that's doing this with Facebook, uh, most likely, and not Facebook itself. So, the kids at Facebook... Uh, Apparently couldn't help me if they tried. Uh, the YouTube thing is working right now. Um, for some reason, yes. Um, uh, do I know why? No, I'm not an idiot. I don't fucking kill people for a paycheck and try to justify it with a bad science project. But, you know, you got to understand, guys. Um, they had a virtual presence and they explained it to me because of who I am in my house from the time I was a kid. Okay. So it, don't imagine, understand that. If we were living the ways of Jesus Christ and then it accepted the uh, affirmation of Muhammad, you know, or, or Hala Slus or anybody along the way, that they wouldn't have been studying me like an animal and then treating me like one and then saying I'm an inferior animal to them. Okay, do you understand? Okay. So there, there wouldn't have been all the sexual deviations. They, they wouldn't be able to manipulate people with sexual comparisons that, like they still do now. Okay, with football. Look at Detroit. You know, you have all these people that can't compete or overweight, and then they destroy them through excessive compulsive behaviors. They have them destroying each other and hating each other through comparing who is more sexually desirable to get more people into the marketplace. All those things that Richard Dawkins talks about that we've been doing, all the dysfunction we've been doing for thousands of years that goes in direct contrast to the intelligence and the faithful love of someone like Abraham. But he rejects Abraham because corporations turn Abraham's faith into irrational mythological gibberish and then when someone comes along and takes the mythology away and turns it back to reality they get all mad because they want their side to win and the other side to lose and then you all bet on fan duel who's going to win and how many touchdowns they're going to score in a goddamn football game and it's disgusting and i'm a man now you act like a man and stop acting like a fucking trained sex cult performance animal on tv because your children don't deserve your fuck they deserve my love now make your love like my love okay uh.